A chain. First down, Aggies. Past the 45. So instead of close to first down yardage, they're outside their own 20. Slings it across the middle, and it's caught by Harvey. His third catch is a first down to the 35. A&M's got Cooper, Edrin Cooper, number 45, sugared up in the line of scrimmage and coming. Running it, and Marks hits the hole hard, and it appears to be enough. Cooper tackled him right at the 45. Let's see where they mark this. That crazy finish on the planes. Here we've got no score, and there goes Devon A-Chain. Camry and Richardson rides him out of bounds, but... One of the best tailbacks in America with a big gain. There is a flag down. You let him out of the gate with a nice run. And this happens sometimes. You got cut loose there towards the end, right? You get a running back. They usually. The first time, Muhammad stands at his own 40. They all have a chance at this one. Here comes Moose around the corner. And stays on his feet inside the 40. Mississippi State wanted a block in the back. They're not going to get it. The Aggies have terrific field position when you come back. He has 61 of AM's 70 offensive yards so far. And he's got the ball here inside the 20, down near the 17. Before the game, Jimbo Fisher was talking about the loss of Anaya Smith. In five games, it's one of the lowest totals in college football. A chain finds another huge hole. He fumbles the ball though, and it's picked up by the Bulldogs. Rogers throws the one on one ball, and it's a great catch by Rara Thomas. It'll kind of dink and dunk you, then they take a shot. That time, Thomas. Does a great job of fighting. Now it's Price getting a block. First down Bulldogs inside the Aggie 40. Second and 10 Bulldogs at the 28. Dylan Johnson right through the big hole. First down Bulldogs near the 11. It's third and three. He's going to try it again, and he's got it. Cue the duck. Well, they go right back to him. Last time it was thrown to the corner, this time back shoulder. You see it right there. How effective the Bulldogs have been in the ground game. Rodgers will go back to the air. And dump it off for a first down. Pass midfield to the 47 goes Justin Robinson for 18 more. Could be four down territory. Third and five. Rodgers won't need another down. It's a first down to Tulu Griffin. And it's first and goal Bulldogs. Rodgers, the catch made. Touchdown. Rufus Harvey gets that right hand in. See him just in and out, pivot right out of that route. You're baiting Johnson on the inside. And, oh, it's pretty close. Those guys in the end zone paint up we want app state of course the aggies lost to them earlier this season here comes a chain he gets through there and if anybody's going to bring the aggies back it's going to be number six that's a 43 yard return johnson on the low snap and he's going down diving back ahead to the 37 but jp purvis was untouched Throws a dart to Moose Muhammad, and Muhammad has the first down inside the 40. Johnson underneath. First down for Donovan Green, the big tight end, breaking a tackle. 
Johnson is going to go down again. Randy Charlton. They fumbled the first time they were down here. Johnson can't take a snack. It's fumbled and picked up. Pookie Watson caused it, and Tyrus Wheat recovered it. In an entire game, and here we are in the middle of the third quarter. Back to the air raid. It's ducking. He scored a touchdown and coughed up the ball. And here's Texas A&M's chance. And it's a 44-yard attempt. And it's blocked. It's picked up. DeCambrian Richardson. By Randy Bond, it's a 44-yard attempt. And it's blocked. It's picked up. DeCambrian Richardson. State with pressure again inside. First down to Muhammad, and he's free. Down inside the 30-yard line. It's a pickup of 37. Johnson to Muhammad. Touchdown. Eighteen-yard reception after the brutal game he had last week. He's in the end zone this week for the Aggies' first touchdown. Muhammad working in the slot versus safety Colin Duncan. Max Johnson knew he had what he wanted. He's on the edge. Johnson, touchdown. He was hit in the backfield, but he fell forward for six. total yards today it is 60 almost 60 underneath their average Johnson's not going to get this one off Javon Banks and J.P. Purvis greet each other in the backfield was ejected due to targeting Max steps up good ball and it's Muhammad with a first down catch near the 40 yard line 26 more for the sophomore On fourth down, King will run and score. Bring the touchdown coming off the bench for him and back to the air goes Rodgers. Caught Rara Thomas. Goodbye. He beats Deuce Harmon for the football, stays upright, and goes 75 yards for the longest play of the season. Get some confidence for Haynes King going into that Alabama game next Saturday, but King is under pressure, stays alive, completes it to Stewart, and Stewart's off to the races inside the 45-yard line. A great job by Haynes King shaking off a would-be tackle. Catch. 26-yard gain, and that's intercepted. Emmanuel Forbes. Hey, look what I found. Tradition they started a few years ago, and it's become a fourth quarter stable at Davis Way. There's Rara Thomas getting this ball out near midfield. Total catches for 134 yards and a touchdown. Woody Marks, first down run inside the 30. Bryce Anderson saved the touchdown. I got to tell you, looking at their two deep, it is remarkable how many young players are on this field. Johnson 
and another pick by Forbes. And he takes it to the house. Hits his fourth career pick six. You see the center judge is like, look, you sub. He contests the sub. Around over. That's his first, excuse me, LJ Johnson. And Johnson, a freshman from Cypress, Texas, gets 14 yards. Still trying to defend that end zone. And Johnson scores the touchdown. Freshman from Cypress, Texas, his second rushing touchdown of the season. And maybe even LJ Johnson moving forward. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.